Welcome to Map TV. Please do subscribe to our channel for more videos. Click on the bell button for notification. Welcome, this is Map TV, and my name is Donald. And today I have something very beautiful to share with you. It, it's something about um, the Punch newspapers. You know, the Punch newspaper happens to be one of the oldest media houses in nigeria it's lasted for 46 years and in case you've not hit the subscribe button please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so when we post videos you receive notifications thank you and if you subscribe already we are eternally grateful to you thank you so much for the support yes this newspaper house which is called the punch i think you know it's very very easy household name in nigeria um they've been very credible and um, they've stood the taste of time and faced a whole lot of challenges too and they've actually proven themselves strong. Martin Zayekuna is the longest serving staff of the Punch newspaper. He's, he's, he has stood with them over time, over the years, and he's been part of them. Then why did they sack him? They sacked him because of this trending issue about Pastor Biodun Fato Imbo and Busola Dakolo. You know, it was said, it was released on July 4th. A particular cartoon was released, which has been taken down, that this man, the editor, Martin, actually drew a cartoon to defame Pastor Fato Yimbo. You know, Pastor Fato Yimbo is the senior pastor of Commonwealth of Zion Assembly, a church which is headquartered in Abuja, which branches all over Nigeria, like a Lauren Lagos, Port Arquette, and uh, which is a member of Abuja, who had an allegation on him by Busola Dakolo that he actually raped her 20 years ago. And there was a protest that came up after the allegation. Why Nigeria actually granted the interview? Protests are led to the man of God stepping down from the pulpit. So the man of God is in seclusion right now and is not functioning as a senior pastor of the church. Cut the long story short. This editor had to make a cartoon to defend the man. Um, and the cartoon detailed that the, the, the pastor, a, a particular pastor, urinating on the Bible and uh, with the name Pastor Biodun Fato Yimbo, which is very defaming. It is an allegation. It is not a proven fact. In investigations are ongoing. It is left for the court to determine if he is guilty. The court to vindicate him for crying out loud. So putting up a cartoon like that is not something that the Punch newspaper is actually proud of. So the Punch newspaper are taking the, the slight opportunity by sacking this um, longest serving staff of the outfit. You know, this man, they said he was suspended and just got back from suspension and he's done a new one and he's he's gotten a compulsory resignation order from the outfit for his, for him to put down his resignation to leave the outfit. So what do you think about this? Do you think it is right to sack this man who served them for a long time? And um, what do you think about the cartoon that is actually defaming the managad? Do you think he actually did the right thing? Whatever you think, do you think it's justifiable since he thinks in his mind that this man is guilty? Uh, which means he has judged him already. So do you think it's right? Do you think it's wrong? Whatever you think, put down your comment on the comment section below. We will respond to them. And please share this video, like it if you like it. Then please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if this is your first time of coming. And I remain Donald and this is Mob TV. Don't go nowhere. <laughs>